Hi there, how are you doing? Welcome to um, another video that um, I've come up with. Um, okay, so um, <laughs> I was watching Big Break. Um, I don't know if you remember that, the, um, the quiz show with the snookers and everything, you know, snooker and everything else. Um, I was watching uh, like a rerun of it and um, it just got me all nostalgic. And um, they were doing, you know, John Vega's trick shots. And um, it just got me, just got me thinking, uh, cooking up this like crazy notion um, of um, you know maybe playing, uh, doing a little trick shot of my own. So I'm thinking, what's an amazing snook again that I could do trick shots with? And um, well, there's only one that I can think of, and that's Jimmy White's Wild Wing Snooker. So um, I've set up my Amiga 600. Um, here it is, and. Um, I told, uh, well, I basically start, I've loaded in the game already, and there it is. Um, bear with me, and what I'll do is I'll get a closer look for you, and I'll show you what I've come up with. Okay, so what you've got there, you can see it very well, a little trick shot that I've set up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the mouse. Um, sorry, bear with me. Okay, so I'm going to use the mouse here and just give you a little. Actually, I'll use the arrow keys and just let you look around. Uh, hang on a sec, bear with me. So, as you can see, I set up a crazy little trick shot right there. Now, I don't know if this will work, and um, I've not tested this before I did it. So, um, I'm thinking. Is this going to work or is it not? Um, I saw something similar on the old John Vergos thing on Big Break, so I figured um, why not try it myself. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to line myself up, and get myself in angle, and get myself in position. Um, I'm just using the arrow keys at the moment uh, just to get myself into position. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do like, um, I put loads and loads of spin on it. I don't know if you can see that there. So, uh, first things first, check the power. Power's good. Let's just make sure that's right. Lots of power, medium power. Mm, we'll try medium power like that. Let's chart the queue and let's get ready to rumble. Okay. Let's just move it a bit this way so you can see and see what happens. Oh no, maybe move it back a little bit. I just want to glance it. Okay, so what we're looking for is to get the black in there. Okay. So let's see what happens. Ready? Oops, sorry. Here we go. Are you ready? And here it goes. Hey! The black went in. <laughs> so there you go. Um, I've done a little trick shot there for you. For and that's on Jimmy White's Whirlwind Snooker. It's been um, it's been fixed. The actual game has been fixed to run on a 600 on on, uh, on an ECS chipset. Um, so I've been trying to find a, a version of the game that works. So I've been, to be fair, I've been spending quite a lot of time um, just checking out the various versions that are available, just to see what I could do in terms of getting it working on my 600. So there you go. Um, <laughs> I'm totally stoked with that, and um, I'm obviously. Um, really pleased that that's working now. So, um, just thought I'd give you a look. I was just feeling kind of nostalgic watching Big Break and stuff like that, and I figured, why not um, do something a bit crazy? So, I've just done a JV esque uh, trick shot there for you, and um, I'm feeling really proud of myself. That was a first take legendary trick shot. Um, so, hopefully, um, that might give you some ideas for trick shots of your own. Let me know. Um, hopefully, have a good one, and um, thanks a lot for watching. Speak to you soon.